Hey guys, this video will be a review on my Qualorex Argan Hand and Body Cream. And I actually have two to show you today. Two flavors or scents, not flavors, you can't eat them. I have Jasmine Vanilla and I also have Lavender. They come in these little containers. The thing I like the most about it is that it has directions on the container and it also has the ingredients listed. No type of parabens, anything like that, all natural ingredients. As I mentioned, it's very lightweight so it takes very little product to soak into your skin so it's really really moisturizing and that's a big plus for me because I have eczema and my skin gets extremely dry and this is not pretty I'm not a pretty sight and also I don't like using too many fragrance lotions because they tend to not work as well not moisturize my skin as well these are actually awesome also great for your cuticles if you have your nails done you want to keep your manicure in check really great for the hands it is a hand and body cream so you can use it all over your body. I would avoid using it on my face just because it is scented and my skin is more sensitive than the rest of my body so I would not do that. It does say you could use it on your face but proceed at your own risk. For me personally I don't want to do that because it's scented and it kind of freaks me out. It's not too heavy of a scent. I might actually try it. I don't know. I might try it just to see because I'm daring like that but it smells really good. Also I like the fact that it's sealed. I leave this on here just so I don't get any of the lotion or hand cream, I'm sorry, into the lid. I don't like that. So I love this layer of protection it has. And it's sealed just like you would buy some medicine from the pharmacy or something. And it has that layer of protection. So that's really nice. Oh my gosh. Oh, the lavender one smells so good. I don't know which one I like the best. <laughs> I really don't. They both smell amazing. I apologize, but this is only available in the United States. I'm so sorry. That's what they have on their website. Just to give you some ingredients, it has argon, organic argon oil, jojoba oil, vitamin E, avocado oil, and other oils, and aloe, and stuff like that. Oftentimes throughout the day, I find myself reapplying my lotion just because it doesn't last, but with this, I rarely have to do that and my skin stays well hydrated. So I'm really impressed with these products. I also got some lip stuff from them. I come in these cute little containers. I got their lip butters. I will show these in a later video. Stay tuned for that video. I'm obsessed with these. I don't wanna to get too deep into it, but I love these. These also smell amazing. So, oh my gosh. Really great homemade company. They hand make all of their products, which I think is awesome. It really, ensures the quality of each product they send out. If you guys would like to see a written detailed review on these two creams, you want to see a comparison of my ashy hands, my ashy legs, my ashy... I'm not going to put my feet on there. It might be a little inappropriate. <laughs> Especially my feet. Y'all don't want to see that. But if you like to see side-by-side -side comparisons of my dry skin versus hydrating myself with the body cream, I'll put a blog post down below. I'll also zoom in real fast just so you can see how hydrating it is briefly. Okay, so this is the lavender. Since I'm doing this, oh, I'm not trying to flip y'all. Since I'm doing this on the back of my hand, I'm not going to use too much product at all. That's probably too much, but compared to the dry, it's not really that dry because I had some on earlier, but look how much shiny that is. Oh my gosh. And I have been washing my hands throughout the day. So for my skin to still look like this, it's just amazing. But my skin is so smooth. It smells amazing. It smells heavenly. It just opens up your, your nostrils. I don't know. I can't explain it. Anyways, detailed written review will be on my blog post down below. And stay tuned for that lip butter review. I'm really excited to show you guys those products as well. If you have any questions, leave them below. Outfit the day post will be in the info box. I'll talk to all of you next time. Thank you so much for watching.